Hello, I want to give you a quick introduction to the new mask and trigger functionality in the latest version of DeepView. On the screen, you can see I've got a live image centered around 436 megahertz. I'm going to create a learnt mask based on the live spectrum. We are going to set the mask 10 dB above the current spectrum. This system is now learning what is normal in the spectrum range and creating this mask line. You can see I've got my 10 dB of separation between existing signal and the trigger line. Let's turn off the mask learning and set the recording trigger. I need to change the trigger type from manual to mask trigger. Here auto rearm specifies how many mask breaks will result in a recording. I've got it set to three, so it'll do three recordings and then stop. Pre-trigger lets you set the time that's recorded before the signal starts so you don't miss any of the event. I'm going to use a car key fob to break the mask. When I set it to record, you can see DeepView is waiting for a signal to trigger the recording. If I press the key fob, you'll see it changes from waiting to recording. If I press it three times, it will trigger the recording again and then finish. I can now go into the analysis mode and look at my recording. I'll add a delta marker here to show the 200 milliseconds of pre-trigger we set. I can zoom in to analyze the signal, and importantly, I am able to see the start of the signal transmission. If you are interested in this feature, please get in touch. For more videos on DeepView, make sure to like and subscribe. Visit crfs.com for more information on DeepView.